What did you cause me, crew? Like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. Without further ado, I got another video for you. Okay, so this is just gonna be real quick. So there have been speculations going on that um, Lil Wayne was supposed to be at the Super Bowl and that um, Jay-Z, Sean Carter, who is on, you know, he's the chairman with the NFL ever since Colin Kaepernick and all that, and that he made uh, some executive decisions so that Lil Wayne wasn't the headliner. Okay, a lot of people are saying, you know, typically it's whoever is from that city who is, you know, performing at the halftime show. And it's just kind of weird that it's Kendrick Lamar. Let's see. Let's see. Does Jay-Z, I don't know why I keep wanting to call him Sean specifically, Sean Carter. I guess because... You know, he's operating, that's his fictitious name, okay? He's operating under his government name. Is Sean Carter responsible for Dwayne Carter? First off, was Dwayne Carter ever potentially going to be at the Super Bowl? Was that ever really a thing? We got Eight of Cups, Page of Cups. Ace of Pentacles in reverse, Death card in reverse, Devil in reverse. I mean, I do, I do feel like it was a possibility. I don't think like I don't, I don't know if they're supposed to get paid. I feel like there are people who Lil Wayne wanted to bring with him who they didn't approve of. Um, so it was always kind of up in the air. What's Eight of Cups? Eight of Wands, Wheel of Fortune. It's like. With his Eight of Cups here, I feel like he was under the guise that that would just be the natural flow of things. And then he had to emotionally detach from that. Okay? But with this Will of Fortune, Eight of Wands, I do feel like there was communication saying like that is what was supposed to happen. But I also feel like because of his own um, requirements and his own um, basically just what he wanted the show to consist of there were you know they were bumping heads with him now i do feel like there we got the lovers here i do so there is a couple here that's involved i don't know if um he's romantically involved with someone i like uh, eh. okay because when i'm feeling when i'm sitting spiritually is that there's definitely people that um are behind the scenes making these choices and it is kind of like you gotta rub shoulders okay you gotta kiss a little ass right and with this ten of pentacles the devil in reverse all of this there definitely is a group effort that turned him away and with this ace of pentacles made sure he didn't get this offer we got a queen of pentacles here so yeah there's a woman here i don't i keep seeing his girlfriend that white woman i don't know what that white woman has to do with anything I don't know if she's supposed to sleep with somebody. Something, somebody about a meal ticket. Like she says, plus one meal ticket. Knight of Swords. <laughs> okay, so I would say, I would say, yeah, it was definitely an offer that was made on the table. But I believe even litigations about it, um, even before sean carter was involved i feel like there was disagreements already just based on what um lil wayne wanted to transpire during his few minutes of fame okay does jay-z have anything to do with this <laughs> we got the emperor yes <laughs> yes Yes, I don't know why people try to make it seem like Jay Z is not like uh, um, a head contributor. He's very well affiliated. He's, I believe, especially something about Lear Cohen as well. Lear Cohen or Liar Cohen, however you say it. Like, he is like the head of that department. Like, literally. That's why Rihanna was just here. Like, literally. Why wouldn't Jay-Z want Lil Wayne to perform? Nine of Cups. 
The Temperance. What's Nine of Cups? The Fool. There's something that Jay Z. That there's something else that Jay Z wanted to see happen, and I is. Are we talking about Kendrick Lamar? Queen of Pentacles. Does this have to do with Beyonce? Beyonce wanted this. I don't know. <laughs> the Ten of Cups. Like this was a family decision. The Seven of Wands, they're protecting some type of type of legacy, some type of dynasty, okay? There's definitely a united front here. We got the Knight of Cups, Judgment. I mean, they're definitely in control. We got the Devil. What's this Devil energy? It's something about um, controlling the masses, okay? So, on one hand, it's just business. Like, it's not really a personal decision. On the other hand, like, there's a family here. Um, familia. <laughs> we got the death card. The devil and the death card, child. For some reason, there's, I'm hearing excommunicated. Like, why does Jay-Z have a vendetta against Lil Wayne? Like, what is this? What is it, like, the moon in reverse? Whatever this is, it has to do with blood sacrifices. It has to do with oaths. It has to do with also um, feelings that have been revealed. The lovers. What is this lovers? The King of Pentacles with the Queen of Pentacles. <sighs> These are definitely very wealthy people. Seven of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles. I don't, this feels like there's a couple here that's making these decisions. Four of Pentacles, like they hold all the, like this is their house, okay? Three of Wands, whatever they envision, the star is what, <laughs> whatever they envision to happen is what is portrayed or what is publicized. Three of Swords here, regardless of who it hurts, regardless of who it disappoints. Page of Swords, King of Cups, Ace of Cups. Two of Pentacles, this is messy. This is messy as hell. I'm going to leave this right here, okay? Until next time.